Good morning, it's Thursday, July 20th, 2023. My name is Russell, and this is Rocky Road Devotions, a few minutes of help for today's journey. Our devotion today is entitled, An Invitation to the Imperfect, and much thanks today to Reverend John Struther for his writing. Matthew chapter 11, verse 28, Jesus said, Come to me, all of you who are weary and carry heavy burdens, and I will give you rest. Hello, I'm the body of Christ, but you may know me by my other name, Church. I'm sure you've heard a lot about me. I've no shortage of critics. Perhaps you've heard that I'm boring, shallow, irrelevant, a waste of time. Maybe you've heard that I'm full of hypocrites, greedy people, the self-righteous. Maybe you've visited me before and discovered music that you didn't like, passionless singing, dry preaching, rude congregations. Maybe you needed me and I was too busy, too righteous, too broke, too blind. Maybe you joined me and found I was distant, demanding, dull, preoccupied. Maybe you tried to serve in me but were caught off guard by business meetings, committees, interpersonal conflicts, bureaucracy. Maybe you left and were surprised that nobody called, cared, or seemed to notice and invite you back. Perhaps your experience has driven you to speak negatively of me. Swear to never come back to me. Proclaim that no one needs me. Believe you're better off without me. If this is true, I have something to say to you. I'm sorry. I was wrong. I blew it. I made a huge mistake. But remember, I never said my name was perfect, flawless, complete, arrived. My name is Church, or more accurately, the Body of Christ. At my best, I welcome the hypocrite, dry, self-righteous, and shallow. I also welcome the sincere, passionate, forgiving, selfless. I cannot shut my doors to the people who make you angry, uncomfortable, impatient, self-conscious. But I would remind you that we couldn't always worship in the same room because of division between Gentiles, Jews, men, women. In order for us to all worship in the same room, Christ was shamed, beaten, killed, and resurrected, which is far worse than being bored, uncomfortable, embarrassed, or ignored. So, why not come back to church and let all these other sojourners challenge you, sharpen you, strengthen you, humble you? I can't promise you that the people will be great. This is church. It's not heaven paradise, Beulah land, the celestial city, or whatever else you might call the great beyond. But do come back, or join us for the first time. God wants you here. The body needs you here. The world needs your witness. You belong here. Hello, my name is Church. I miss you. I love you. I'm sorry. Can't wait to see you. For you today, this is evangelism, reconciliation between siblings, and the humility Christ offered to each of us. This is what the church, all of us, needs to offer to the world today. You chew on that as you hit the rocky road. Have a blessed day.